sir. You was always a good chiseler. Get out of here! <laughs> Professor, Felix is being interviewed. By the police, I hope. <laughs> nah, he's telling a commentator about Boyd's. He always was for the birds. And so, as you can see, I've gathered exotic birds from all over the world. Well, Felix, I'd like to see some of your special breeds. Okay, a hi-fi pelican with his favorite record. Felix the cat, the wonderful, wonderful cat. <laughs> Very funny, Felix. Now, here is one of my favorites. Heady Easter from the Easter Islands. Okay, Heady. Very clever. Have you got something special? Yes, I have. A jewel bird. Here is a picture of it. Every day it flies out into the dense jungles, finds old palaces and their treasure rooms. It feeds on gems. It's there now. Gems! Uh, will I see it? Here it comes. <laughs> lays two eggs. A day? More. It makes many trips. <laughs> two. A bird in one, gems in the other. This one has the gems. I hope. I must have that bird. I must. Come, Rock. To the costume room. What'll I do when we get to Felix's, Professor? Uh, act like a mother bird. And I'm your baby. Run, run! Oh! Go over by the fire and warm yourself. Unbearable. I'm getting warm. Yow! Yow! The professor and, and rock bottom. You crooks, get out of here! Don't open till Christmas. <laughs> Don't open till Christmas. <laughs> Felix. You're in there because you interfered in our plans. You're right. You're going to take away my bird experiment laboratory. Let me out of here. Felix, all I'm taking from you is the jewel bird that lays gem-loaded eggs. It's not here. It's out in the jungle. Get rid of him, Rock. We've things to do. On your way. Who'd want them queer boys? This is the one I want. The jewel bird. It finds treasure rooms in old palaces and feeds on gems. What's that? Who's there? My red-headed woodpecker. Why doesn't the jewel bird return? Keep it up! Ah, here it comes. Now it's laying two eggs. But it's not going to get out on another trip. Not yet. Ready, Rock. Try this one. Marvelous, marvelous. But this way is too slow. There is a fast 
better way. Bring the bird, Rock, and we'll get all the gems. Now to catch those crooks. We're catching up, Pelly. The jewel bird has landed. Wow, look at them gems. Marshaled. 
Knock him up, General! Okay, Earthman. Any last words? Yes. Why all the rocket ships? Rockets for invasion. We take over Earth. The Earth? When? Soon as Point Dexter make no rocket fuel. Ours only good halfway. So, that's why they wanted Point Dexter. Uh, General, what are you going to be when you get to Earth? Be president, of course. What country? All countries. Then you'll have to learn the Maypole dance. The Maypole dance? A dance all presidents must do when they take office. Show me. Okay, turn me loose. Now get up on your toes. Like this? That's it. Now give me your, uh, uh, hand. <laughs> I wonder how Poindexter is coming along with the super rocket fuel. I'll give him a ring. Yes, Mr. Cylinder. Just one more ingredient, and we're off with a bang. How much longer this maple dance? Just one more step, General.
Starbug, Mungo Jingo. Down? That bug's crazy. There they are, right below. Thanks for the lift. This is all ice. I've come for my golden bug. Oh, no, no. Felix, the ice ledge is breaking behind you. Look. Wow! This glacier is running wild. to have hair on our heads. I bought this from an explorer who grew his own hair. And here is proof, before and after. In the heart of the dangerous jungle grows the hairy berry bush. Eat these berries and you'll grow curls. Only one person can bring that bush back, and that is Fearless Felix. Gentlemen, you'll get your hair. Hey, Professor, Felix has got his picture in the paper. For something fatal, I hope. Now, nah, he's gonna get $50,000. <laughs> For what? Felix goes to jungles. Ball Heads Incorporated to pay him $50,000 to bring back special berry push. What? For berries? Yeah, these berries will absolutely grow hair. Grow hair? Grow hair? Wonderful! Yeah, look here. He is being given the secret map. We must get that map and find the berry bush. Don't move. Here he comes. <laughs> Quick, Rock. Don't let him out of sight. This is traveling in style, huh, boss? Yes, Rock. This way, we'll head Felix off. Tunnel ahead, Rock. Stop rocking the alligator, or we'll spill. Whoa, whoa, hold it there, alligator. Hold it. That's the last time I ever trust a gator. Let's land at the rubber grove ahead, Rock. Now? through the Robert Forest. So this is where Felix will pass. Right. Now chop a slice out of a rubber tree and catch the rubber sap. Quick, up a tree. Here he comes. Felix, are you too stuck up to speak to old friends? Oh! Why am I trapped in this rubber sack? To get this secret map to the special berry bush. What do you know about it? Those 
those berries will grow hair. Mmm, coily hair. How did you hear about it? It tells in this clipping, chump. So what? Bald Heads Incorporated hired me to find the bush. We're taking over. Come, Rob. Stick around, pal. Ho, 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 ho. I, I'm getting loose now. Rubber sack. On both sides. And stiff. We'll take a shortcut through the swamp. What's this? Hippopotamus! Please, Professor, no more shortcuts. Right, Rock. This rubber sure can stretch. Now to get the crooks. Roger's elephants below. Hmm, right over them. Ready? Aim. <laughs> He's 
PC. Contact made. Okay, turn on the suction pump and haul up. There goes another one. Here comes another elephant for our collection. Uh-oh, there's the Rajah's palace. I nearly passed it. Felix, hurrah! You're here. Be right with you, Raja. Must repack my little bag of tricks. You've come just in time. Last night, they stole more of my prize elephants. Don't worry, Raja. I'll build a trap and catch them tonight. This will fool them long enough for me to arrest them. Felix, get ready. I hear them coming. Contact, boss. Suction. All in. I hope he knows what he is doing. So far, so good. They think they're stealing a Rajah's elephant. This elephant looks very strange. Boss, I think we stole a sick one. We're over our camp. I'll look after we land. Okay, we've landed. Now let's look at it. That's no elephant. It's a fake. Rock Bottom and the Professor! You crooks! No, no, no! It's Felix! I'm placing you under arrest. Get him, Rock. Come here, chump. Hang him high. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. the cut hangs high. You'll pay for this. Come, Rock. Don't fall and crush the elephants. Ho, 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 ho. When I get free, you'll go to jail. Jumbo! Do you hear me, Jumbo? Pull me free, and I'll take you all back to the Rajah. before we start again. As soon as I fix this switch. Heads up, we're underway. Over the elephants. Lower suction cup. These bees will surprise them. Service. The culprits at your service. 
make them wash the elephants twice. Oh, what's the use? <laughs> invention, the Tell Exchanger, a device to exchange objects at great distances. First, I put fake Poindexter in here. Tune in location to the real Poindexter. <laughs> Dexter, it's your bedtime. Point Dexter, speak to me. This must be the work of the master cylinder. And now, get to work on that rocket fuel formula, Point Dexter. Sorry, no deal. What? I'm lonesome. I want my babysitter, Felix. Felix? Not that pest. Uh, Master, look. Felix the cat. A rather poor imitation of him. It will do. Watch. <laughs> Felix, what happened to Poindexter? Poindexter a robot and Felix a rag doll. What happened? <laughs> Poindexter, where are we? We're on Mars, Mr. Felix. Mars? I don't understand. We were brought here with this tele-exchanger. Back on Earth, we are dummies. But why? The master cylinder wants me to work on the super rocket fuel. I get it. So he can invade the Earth. That's the reason for all those rocket ships. Enough of this chit-chat. Poindexter, get to work in the laboratory while we show Felix the sights. Okay. See you soon, Mr. Felix. Felix, you ask for it. Grab him, General. No, you don't. Let him go, General. 
If he doesn't starve, the talking rocks will drive him crazy. Gee, what a place. Nothing but rocks. Cheer up, Felix. Who said that? I did. You a rock talking? Not a rock. A Martian. We're in disguise. What's your problem? How can I rescue Poindexter, Mr. Martian? Mm, let me think. I've got it. Here. Hmm, a rock suit. Put it on. How do I look? A perfect fit. Now move cautiously. Thanks. Another explosion. We'll never get that super rocket fuel. Poindexter, are you all right? Yes, Mr. Felix, but look. The rocks are rolling. Look, Master, rocks. A landslide. Let's run. Run. With what? I'll save you, Master. Look at them go! Good old Martians! I can't understand it. Is anything wrong, Uncle? Yes, Professor. You look worried. Oh, no! It is impossible. <laughs> Poindexter, let's have the formula for the super rocket fuel. My lips are sealed. We'll unseal them. What's that? Another fish is on hook, Master. It's Mr. Felix. General, tie him to the killer tree. Killer tree? We meet again, Felix, no? Don't despair, Mr. Felix. Hey, the tree is shaking. Who are you? Shh, I'm a Martian. We've gone partially underground. See? A hole? A tunnel. It leads to the bottomless dry well and escape. Hurry, get in. Thanks, Mr. Martian. Good luck. Now listen, my boy. Give me the formula and I'll make you the head of research on all Earth. Good job with Social Security Welfare. No, Felix, no formula. Shall I squeeze it out of him, Master? No, dangle him over the bottomless dry well until he talks. The formula, please. Never. Oops, slip. What? You drop Poindexter into the bottomless dry well? Sorry, Master. I'm butter tentacled and butter brained. You're demoted to private. Report for cleanup detail. Now for the flying saucer. Goodbye, Mr. Cylinder. But I. Uh... Get him yet. 
that. Goodbye, Mr. Martian. Uh oh, the general. Goodbye, General Clay. Lad, are you Felix the investigator? Why didn't you come through the door? Mm, Tis bad luck for a leprechaun to go through a door. Have a chair and tell me your troubles. Troubles I have. Last night, out in the fairy ring, we leprechauns were enjoying a peaceful pipe, when suddenly there came a scream like that of a wild banshee. Yo! Wow, 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 yo! Tiny Joe. Hmm. Then what happened? It was horrible, horrible, horrible. Next, they used traps. Help! Turn me loose! Ouch! Ouch! And they caught more? That they did. Then they used fly paper. But why are they after you? Here, read it. Notice to Chief Leprechaun. We have captured 15 leprechauns. They will be released on receipt of 15 pots of gold. Make it snappy. Wow, but why 15 pots of gold? It's our law. If a leprechaun is captured, he must pay a pot of gold for his freedom. Don't pay the crooks. I'll find a way to free the leprechauns. Ah, bless ye, lad. And now I must be away. Start looking around at the fairy ring. Why, there's no trap door here. There is when you need one. Here's the fairy ring. Now to find a clue. Hey, a trap snap. We've got another leprechaun. This is a heavy one. Let him loose for the noose. Felix. No, no, no! You crooks! I'm putting you under arrest. Felix, you're doing no such thing. You're in a trap, a lobster trap. <laughs> Felix, you always stick your neck in trouble when you butt into our business. Your business is capturing poor leprechauns for their gold. It's legal, their law. Ask them. Ah, me, tis true. If a leprechaun is captured, he must pay a pot of gold for his freedom. It's not right to take all their gold. But very profitable. Ah, we're safe now. Felix will stop the shenanigans. Oh, boy. <laughs> Hey, boss, there's a flock of leprechauns just waiting to be captured. Fine, fine. Let's not keep them waiting. You'll pay when I get free. Yeah! Yow! Wow, wow! They've got me. Me too. How am I going 
time to get out of this lobster pot. He try whistling like a bird, high and low, for the chief leprechaun. Like this? <whistles> ah, glory be, just trouble you're in. Well, I'll be after making you free. Then Felix can free us, as only a human can do that. Duck your head so as I can free you. <whistles> One and all! <laughs> 